Here I am in the small town of Mount Garnett, just at the foothills, or the foot of the Atherton Tablelands. Um, there's a uh, Mount Garnett Hotel there. Looks a nice pub. But I now, um... There you go, buddy. G'day. <laughs> I now head east, continue heading east, over the Atherton Tablelands and I start with climbing that hill <laughs> Having just ridden through a very uh, intense construction site road crew doing wor road works I uh, continue my journey east Continue my journey east towards Inet Hot Springs and a few hills by the looks of it. Alright, I've just arrived finally at Inet Hot Springs. And that's the little township down there. And that's where I'll be staying tonight. It's only been a short day's ride, 42 kilometres, and it's not even 12 o'clock. Well, I've checked into the caravan park, I've uh, pitched my tent right there, and as I just pan to the right, I can see some, not all, but it's some of the uh, hot thermal pools um, that are fed by thermal water coming up from the ground. There's six or seven of them, and each one is a different temperature depending on how sore your muscles are, I think. Here we have the Hot Springs pub where, yes, tonight I hope to get a meal. <laughs> it's just after 6.30 in the morning here at Inn at Hot Springs and because the air is cold, it's about 12 degrees here at the moment and the water's warm, you can see all the steam rising off the water. just left uh, in at Hot Springs about 10 minutes ago and I continue my journey east towards Ravenshoe and then Atherton and eventually Younger Borough tonight which is just over 80 kilometres away uh, but this morning unlike every other morning I have to deal with a thick fog it has visibility down to about 100 metres and um, a fair bit of traffic on the road as well but uh, 
it should lift in a uh, hour or so, and um, blue sky should be be on the horizon. So sunny days ahead. Well, I'm just about five kilometres out of Ravenshoe, and I've just stopped to uh, rest my legs before I tackle another hill. I've also stopped to have a uh, fruity frog. But uh, it's official that we are in the Atherton Tablelands now, because as you can see, it's a lot more lush and green as it has been the last, well, the last two weeks, really. And it's a sign to Millstream Falls, but I'm not going there. I may have already been there once in my life, 15 years ago. But onward I go. Okay, I'm just on the edge of the township of Ravenshoe. Uh, that's it over there, I think. And there's a roadhouse just behind me. Um, this is in fact Queensland's highest town and they also are home to Queensland high Queensland's highest pub as well. And just zooming in way out into the distance. You should be able to see some wind generators up there on the hill. Not much of a wind today, by the looks of it, which is good. But I'm going to continue north to Atherton. Here I am atop Windy Hill, where all the wind generators are. Um, called Windy Hill because it's windy obviously, not after the, uh, the Essendon home ground. Um, give you a diagram there of what's what. And right in front of me I got a big one. I actually hear it. Apparently there's 20 all up around the place. There's one over there, however. That one through there, that needs a bit more WD-40, it's not spinning. Needs to be greased up a bit. <laughs> 